Okay, if you're wondering, it's hot. I'm sorry. But today, it's going to be a bit more of a casual video. And uh, if you're going to judge, whatever, I've been slimming down, so I'm happy with that. So if you're going to judge, go ahead. I don't care. We got two blades that are almost identical. Bowie and uh, normal. These are both the Cold Steel Bushman. You've got the Bowie sheath and the normal sheath. They both the same plastic and clip. The little ferro rod. Both decorated with big cats from the North American continent. We've got a Jaguar and a Puma. Sweet. Both are SK5 steel with a shallow hollow grind. And I did remove the coating and I modified the spine because I blued it. Next. Go get it, boy. Toss your dog a stick. Now then, we're gonna chop first. As I said, it's hot. Not bad. These do make pretty dang good throwing knives, and I almost just slashed my hand by accident. Whoa. Get stuck. I don't know why this one's getting stuck. I'm just trying to be careful. There we go. I wonder if this one had a harder time because it's lighter. Like, look how, like, look at this. They're both about the same length, but I think this one is wider. If I had to guess, hang on. I wanna grab those pieces I just chopped because we're gonna baton them. bad at all. It's a bit to the side, but we're going to try to do the same thing. Because I don't want to put these through too much. These are not these are not crazy hard uses. These are relatively thin knives. They perform pretty similarly. Next up is fire. Next up we're going to try feather sticking. I got a little pine here. It's not fat wood. It's just normal pine. I did make sure both these were nice and sharp before I brought them out. Oh yeah. Well, for you ask, I don't know why I tried going with the Tarzan look. All right, as I said, I modified the spine. I hope I did a good enough job. It's pretty wet out. It's very humid. That's why. That's why I'm doing this. There you go. Yeah. Small area I have to work on, so that might be what's going on here. Whew. All right. There we go. Whoa. Even if it's wet. Even if it's pretty wet out, you want to stamp the sucker out. Alright, we're going to use the exact same piece of wood with the other knife. Just keep it fair. If I get this stupid ferro rod right in my pocket. It's a bit delirious right now. It's hot, as I said. We're getting roughly the same. I think we've had pretty much identical test results except for chopping. You would probably expect that. It's the same bloody knife. 
it's gonna make link gonna make finding the links for it that much easier. I'll tell you that much. For me, that is. I'm low on steam lately. So the humidity is not my friend right now. Had it for a second. I don't think I did as good of a job on this spine. <sighs> you know what? Yeah, I didn't do as good of a job on this spine, I think. <sighs> as I said, it's just too hot for me to want to keep going with, with that. I'm gonna get frustrated. I just cut this off so we can make a point. I'm gonna chop off this piece too. Do it as fair as possible. I don't know what kind of wood this is. Oh. Nix. Nixon! Come on! He's never done that before. Just stop in front of the damn camera. Video's probably gonna be relatively short because of the heat. Should have had water out here. I know. Here's the point. It's not really good throwing knives. I think it might be a little easier to swing this one because of the lighter weight. Uh, or I'm just delirious and thinking it is. I, but I definitely feel like I have a little more control with it. There's the point we got. <sighs> sorry, sorry, I'm just, it is that hot out here and I'm just, so the prices are going to be well, pretty much identical. It's an identical knife. Nice. The balance is really good. But the winner, I have to say is this one because as I said, the exact same knife, but I just like this look better. Yeah, almost out of steam. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching.